Innovation and Design Thinking IDT VTU Module 2 Additional Questions with Answers What is Customer Journey Map? It is a map to locate where the customer has traveled. This only applies to the travel industry since it involves maps. See, it is typically journey of a customer who goes through a certain experience. D. The map that leads us to a profit-making enterprise. Answer. C. It is typically journey of a customer who goes through a certain experience. 2. For building a customer journey map, we interview only one customer. True. False. Answer. B. False. 3. The customer in customer journey map is one who uses a product service and may need help. B. Makes profit for design thinkers. C. Is a designer who wants help with the project. D. Helps build the prototypes that may be useful later on. Answer. A. Uses a product service and may need help. 4. The process of customer journey map, CJM, consists of adding smileys and sad faces to some steps, creating a fictional persona with age, geography and sex, praise a typical person's journey through interviewing many customers. All of the above. Answer. D. All of the above. 5. We do not track the emotional status of a customer in CJM. True. B. False. Answer. B. False. 6. The how might we statements are mainly to set a design thinking project goal. B. To challenge status quo of the customer situation. C. Inspire the design team to think beyond the ordinary solutions. D. All of the above. Answer. D. All of the above. 7. Typically, how many HMW questions are okay for the purpose of CJM? The more the better. B. 2 to 3. C. 1. D. None. Answer. B. 2 to 3. 8. The test phase deals with. An iterative process with many customers will help you to figure out the strength of the concept. B. Get in the shoes of the customers and understand the situation from their perspective. C. Being creative ideas to forefront using your team's best minds. D. Prototype a concept and check if it stands the test of the market. Answer. D. Prototype a concept and check if it stands the test of the market. 9. The reasons we do prototype is R. Give form to the ideas from our previous step. Improve our ability to work with real objects. C. Helps us communicate our ideas to the end customer. D. All of the above. Answer. D. All of the above. 10. Who is the recommended group that you should test out the prototypes with? Your targeted customers. People in your team. Professional designers. Experts. Answer. A. Your targeted customers. Thanks for watching. Comment for any suggestions. Like, share and subscribe for more videos.